Hey, what is up? This will be a very fast troubleshooting video. Sometimes you'll get MXF video files to edit, right? Maybe your client will deliver MXF video files. If I just click and drag this video file on my project, and then if I just click and drag it to make a sequence, you can see there isn't any audio file. Usually what happens when you are recording the video in MXF video format, the Handycam usually makes the audio separate right here is the proper folder structure of those video so in the video folder you will get all the video files and in the audio folder you will get all the audio files in premiere pro you can directly edit mxf video file but you need to have the proper folder structure if i click and drag the video file from this folder then it will contain the audio file now if i click and drag it on my timeline you can see here the audio files contains the video but if i click and drag the video file only if i don't have the audio file it will not full up the audio file so make sure when you are editing the videos in mxm video format you need to have the profile folder structure the fastest way to use the mxf video format is go to window then enable media browser and from here just navigate where you have saved the video files for me here is the folder and from here i can click and drag the video file directly here on my timeline and i can use that file to edit my video so that is all that is how you can use mxf video file in adobe premiere pro that's all for today i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have entered this video and learned something new from this one then please give me a thumbs up and if you're new to this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro video editing then subscribe to this channel to get more video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye